It's that time again. We have something very special for today's Video Game Storytime Advent Calendar. A world exclusive, thanks to a little bit of genuine journalism on our part. Ever wondered why Papyrus and Sans from Undertale are skeletons? They're actually a reference to the popular webcomic Helvetica, which, as you might have guessed, is about a skeleton that's named after a font. A couple of years ago, we had the privilege of interviewing the extremely talented J.N. Weedel, creator of Helvetica, who has also worked on a variety of other projects you may have heard of, such as the Sonic Mania Adventures animations. When we spoke to them, they were kind enough to explain how and why Toby Fox designed Papyrus and Sands. Toby and I have become friends through our mutual interest slash involvement in Homestuck. The details on this are muddy in my memory, but sometime in 2013, Toby was like, I'm making a game! And I was like, oh cool, I'm excited! I didn't know what to expect, lol. I remember when the demo dropped, and Sans and Papyrus were included in it as a gesture from Toby to me. They were created as a joke on my character, Helvetica. For context, Helvetica, the font, is well utilised by graphic designers because of its uniformity and crispness. Comic Sans and Papyrus, however, are very disliked and looked down upon. A lot of graphic designers who are just starting out often go overboard in their hate of these fonts. LOL. So, in a way, Sans and Papyrus were kind of like cheap knockoffs of Helvetica. Of course, they became so much more. The full interview that J.N. Weedle gave us is absolutely fascinating, but we had to put it to one side and never quite finished our video on their contributions to Undertale. Perhaps we'll try and get it done for the release of Deltarune Chapter 2, whenever that happens. In the meantime, we'll see you tomorrow for the next tiny advent calendar video. We'll be covering the origin of Waluigi and why he and Wario don't have girlfriends.